Hey, and welcome back to Squiddy Plays. Today, we're gonna be checking out some more simple planes. Yeah, we're back. We got ourselves a nice cool hat uh, because I wanted to get in the mood for flying. We passed flight school, so I was awarded a hat, my aviator hat. So we're gonna play some more today. We're gonna click play. Uh, in the last episode, what we managed to do is do the short takeoff with the Squid Nook one. We did the carrier landing. So today, we're gonna be checking out going the distance. So. Take off from the USS Beast and fly as far as you can. The catch is, you only have a quarter gallon of fuel. You will crash into the water. We will make sure someone rescues you before you sink. You can trust us. Okay, I'm just going to turn the music down. I don't know why it's on again. There we go. It's turned all the way down now. So let's do this. Let's go go in the distance. So I'm going to stick with the Squid Nug one. Um, I've put these wheels on since the last episode. Uh, but apart from that, nothing has changed. Literally nothing has changed. So... Let's get into it. Let's go. Let's see what this is all about then. So, let's power up if we can. That's the wrong one. That's actually a break. I was pressing break then. Here we go. Oh, we've run out of juice. <laughs> what? Is that it? Can we, can we even move now? I think we can't move, can we? No, we went like... We, we, we need to fly at least 10,000 feet. Wait a minute. How much juice do we have? What about if we go slowly? Look how fast our fuel's going down. If we do like 6%. Okay, <laughs> I think I don't know what we, what we need to do now. We need to try and make a lighter squid nug plane, okay? Because this obviously won't do. We've obviously got uh, hardly no fuel, so we need to try and make something that's tiny. So let's go for a new aircraft. And here it is. We're going to be like sat in there like this. Urgh, come on. So we need to add uh, a couple of things to it. I'm guessing the like jet engines are going to be way like more um, fuel expensive uh, than something like a propeller. So what about if we just do like a teeny tiny little little thing? Let's get ourselves. Uh, we need some structural things, I guess. So let's just do like a block there. This is my first time actually building a plane, so I don't know how. Uh, it works. <laughs> Before, I kind of got given the Squid Nug one. Uh, so this is definitely like my first kind of, uh, you know, my first proper go at building a plane. I think what we need to do is we need to add ourselves um, maybe a little bit of a, a bigger block. Let's just bring these blocks back a bit. And then we'll attach the wings to this bit. I know I could do it like symmetrical, but it's not going to take me that long of a time, is it? Let's be honest. So let's put another one there. Uh, we need some blocks, uh, let's do some blocks there and there, and then I guess what we kind of need is we need like a tail for it because it needs to, um, yeah, <laughs> that's basically what it needs. So let's go to wings, let's go to vertical stabilizer if we put one, not there squid, there we go, on top, and then I guess it's kind of, is that it? Is that going to be alright? It needs to be light, so I'm just kind of going the bare minimum right now. We just, how do we flip blocks around? Can we flip blocks? Oh, there we go. It's, uh, it's actually Q. So if we just keep flipping this, if we can. Uh, it's not going where I want it. I actually want it to face the other way. But it just doesn't seem to want to work. So, what I'm going to do is we're going to put a propeller on this thing here. Because I'm, I'm guessing that it's the best type of proportion. Let's have a look. Uh, is it... Is it? I don't even know if it is or not. Let's just try for the, the blade, right? Let's just go for this simple one. It looks so stupid, doesn't it? Do we need a fuel tank for it? I'm guessing that we need some kind of fuel tank for it. Um, Do we? I, don't, I haven't seen one on before. Unless we put one there and then one like there. Do we put a fuel tank on the propeller? Does that work? Does it have... <laughs> okay then, I'm guessing that doesn't work. I don't want to restart. I know what happened before. It blew up. Right, obviously we need to do some some other things for now. We just need to add a couple more things onto it. Maybe some wings. If we add a block... Wait, I don't want this block there. I want it there. There we go. So no, what, now what we need to do is we need to add uh, some wings. Some, like, landing gears for some wings. Some wing landing gears. That's what I meant to say. So if we pop one there... I kind of want this to be symmetrical. But I guess it doesn't have to be, does it? It doesn't... Doesn't have to be symmetrical. Right, let's put this one like if we can drag it. I'm guessing it's like there. I think we use these to twist it. Do we use these to twist it? That way. There we go. 
now that's just going to go on its nose, isn't it? So maybe if we put another large retractable landing gear here, that's probably too close to propeller. What if we do this? There we go. Right, what happens if we add speed now? <laughs> oh, are we, gonna, are we ever going to be able to lift off? It doesn't pull up. Why does it not pull up? Does it have a pull up gear? Does it have flaps? Okay, it turns right and left. Can we pull up from it? I don't know if we can or not. Did we not add that bit? I'm such a noob. I don't even know what I'm doing, to be honest. I'm just winging it right now. Do you get it? Winging it because it's a plane. <sighs> right, um, primary wing. We put that on. Horizontal stabilizer, vertical stabilizer, primary wing, structural wing. Hmm. What happens if we put one of these, these thingamabobbies on? Is this going to work? I mean, what happened with it before? I just don't think the propeller's cut out for this job. I don't think it's a propeller job. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I don't. I think it's uh, I think it's a little bit more of a uh, a little turbo jet. Let's try one of these. Small and compact. Packs a lot of power in a small space. Here we go. So what we're going to need is we're going to need a long pylon again. Chuck one of these in there. Chuck one of these in there. Not very symmetrical. Don't really care to be honest with you, but it's fine. Right, so we just grab this. Pop that on there. And then we needed, we needed like, intakes or something, like last time. I believe that was what it was called. Right, so put this one. Oh, no. Oh. Uh, excuse me. Yeah. What's happened there, then? Why is that? You know what? I don't even care. That's, <laughs> as long as it works. Right, slim inlet. Right, let's put you... No. Eh. Uh. No, can we... I just want this. I just want this. Can we undo? How do we undo? I did a boo-boo. There we go. <laughs> right, let's do this again. So we need a slim inlet. There. Slim inlet. There. <laughs> it just fell on the floor. That is amazing. It went like, no. <laughs> Look. <dump. laughs> Brilliant. Why are you not? Why are you not like on the plane? What's wrong with you, mate? Yes, this is what I'm talking about. If we move the wings, actually, a little bit more central. This vehicle is perfect. It's tiny. It's got two little wheels on it. It's got a big jet at the back. What could go wrong with this thing? Nothing. Here we go, guys. Here we go. It's a little bit unstable. <laughs> Where are you going? Come back. What if we just put it on full power from the start? Go. Yes. Pull up. No, oh, he's doing so well. Hmm. This is so tough. 10,000. How are we supposed to fly for 10,000? Maybe I'm. Maybe we do need a propeller. I think if we put two massive engines on the back, then we'll be able to do this. So let's get the biggest engines. Look at this. <laughs> is that the wrong way around? It is as well. Wait, how can we... Can we turn it? Is that gonna... Oh, my words. Look at this. Look at this. Yes! <laughs> we used all the fuel like that. <laughs> oh, man. This is so tough, though. I thought it'd be a little bit easier than this. I've built, like, the smallest plane possible. Hmm. Right, so I've messed around with the Squid Nut Wong for a while. And I've come up with this. So I've just basically done a simple thing. I've basically got rid of all the weight that I could possibly can. Um, and we've got, like, a, a propeller on the front. Just one propeller. And, uh, yeah, we've tweaked around the settings. It's a 1,000 horsepower. These actually do a lot. I wonder if I make these, like, super big. Maybe not that big because it might get in the way of the wheels a little bit. But if I make it kind of big... And if I make the blades really thick, then I wonder if we can actually try and do this. Because so far, it's been really unsuccessful. I have a lot of troubles with this challenge. So I'm hoping that this is going to be a lot better. But it's... <laughs> okay. It was touching the ground. That was what was wrong with it. It was touching the ground. So if we just take these up a teeny tiny bit, then we should be a lot better. I don't think that's touching the ground, is it? Nope. Okay, we have to... Oh, no, it did. 
Do we have to make it even smaller? Okay, right, let's put it back down to 90. And then we gotta constantly pull up so it doesn't drag on the floor. Right, so let's do it to about half, about 45, 50%. Get ready to put the landing gear up. Ready? Now, bit more power. Keep us in the air, bit less. <gasps> Look at it, we're going. We're going, guys. Oh, man. Right, let's see how far we can actually get. So we're at 3,500 feet across now. 4,000. Still about 100 miles an hour. We're doing all right. Come on. Come on, my little glider. Come on. Yes, this is good. Okay, we're going to go 6,000. This isn't bad, okay? 6,500. 7... We're just going to make it past seven. We're so close to the end, though. Seven and a half thousand. We need to fly at least oh, ten, ten to ten thousand feet. Right, what can we do to this? I've, I've, I've looked at some stuff, and there's actually a thing called a detacher, which says, use these to drop missiles, uh, a mini aircraft, or create an ejector seat for last second bailout. Select a detacher and click the part options icon to change which group it's assigned to. So, I guess if I hold that... And then if I activate it to the propeller. Don't really know how I'm supposed to do it. How do I detach? How do I put a detacher on this? Like that, maybe? Detach force. Not bothered. Activation group one. So does this mean if I press one now? <laughs> Nothing actually happens. I think what it means is that if I actually just take this... And then I put this on there. And then I put this on there. Does that not work? Surely that works. If I just pop it on the front. And then it should de detach the propeller. Because the propeller's kind of heavy. Like that. <laughs> it's detached too soon. Um, How are we supposed to do this? Now, I'm sure there's an easier way to do this. This detach is obviously not going to work for me. I wonder if we could have the aircraft... Hmm, let's have a look. I want to try and do other stuff. Let's see if we can... Can we make the wings smaller? <gasps> look at this! Okay. What about if we made the wings... Actually, gliders need to have super long wings, don't they? Yes! Here we go. Super long wings at your service. Uh... And that should be good if we just make this the same on the other side. <laughs> uh, symmetrical. Uh, there we go. <laughs> should we see if this flies now? This should be amazing if it could fly. Gliders have super long wings because it's super efficient. So if we do like this. No. Come on. Maybe we did it too fast. Okay, let's just go to like 40%. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. You've got this. Get ready to put the wings up. Wings up. Yes. Look at this go. We've still got a lot of fuel. Maybe if we just slowly gain altitude. Here we go. I've still got so much fuel. Okay, now we haven't. Now we should, through Squid's theory, just glide all the way back home. Now, this is my theory, by the way, so I don't know if this is going to work completely, but... It's looking good so far. Maybe if we just nose dive a little bit, gain some more speed and pull it up a little bit. Seven and a half thousands to beat. Kind of going in the wrong direction, but it's fine. We might beat seven and a half thousand here. This is good. Yes, we have. Come on. Keep going, glider. Keep going, glider. Keep going. Eight thousand. Eight and a half thousand. Come on! Nine thousand over nine thousand! Come on! Nine and a half! Oh, we were so close! <laughs> we were so close! I spent so... I've spent a long... I feel like I'm recording like 40 minutes so far on this challenge. This is a long challenge. Okay, let's do the same on these back wings, because I believe we can do the same. If we make this back wing the same... Yes, this is good. This is good. Let's just symmetrically make it symmetrical. I don't know what I'm trying to say then. Hey, no, come back. Symmetrical. I, this, this is so confusing. No, I keep doing the wrong thing. It just about works. Look. 
Right, here we go. We're gonna get some power going. Yes, this is good, squid. Here we go! Landing gears up! Need a bit more fuel to get us off the ground. Woo! Turn down the fuel. <laughs> and now we just glide. Now we just become a paper airplane all the way to 10,000. I'm hoping. This is ridiculous. I mean, I guess what this is what the game wanted me to make. Something as magical as this. It is literally like a paper airplane, though. I'm, I'm, I'm veering off to the right a little bit. Don't know if I'm going to make this. I don't think I am going to make this, but... I might come close. I might come close. I'm gliding smoothly down. We're on 7,500 feet already. This is amazing. This is super good. Come on, squid. I think we're just going to make it to this green bit. We might actually make it here. Ready? 8,500 feet. Come on, quick, 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 quick. Oh, no. Oh, no. Come on! We're going to be so close. I think we're going to make it. Are we going to make it? Yes, we did it! 10,000 feet with our paper aeroplane. We got to 11,000 here. I mean, that is pretty impressive. With the fuel that we had, that is legit. I am super happy. Yes, we finally did it. I spent so long on that level. Literally been recording for like 45 minutes now. But I'm super happy. Okay, let's do one more challenge and I'm going to end today's video there. So let's see. Actually, I want to save this. Let's just save this because this is, this is done me proud today. Let's do the... Uh, squid Nug one on a diet. There we go. <laughs> right. Max ground speed. In this level, keep, let's keep it on the ground. Create a wheel, a wheeled beast that can break the land speed record of 763 miles an hour before hitting the end of the runway. Okay, this is good, though. This is good. Because, okay, I'm going to start again because i got a good feeling about this. Be because I think we've got unlimited fuel here. So if I do this... And we just create, instead of wheeled beast, which means that we shouldn't need to add any wings. I don't think it wants us to add any wings. If we add some wings, we're probably going to fail. So let's just add a butt ton of this stuff here. Now, what I'm thinking of is I'm thinking if we add something like this, and then if we add uh, maybe some blocks to, maybe if we just make it like a car. So if we just put something like this, something at the back. Turn around. I could do the symmetry thing, but you know what? It doesn't take me that long to make, so that's fine. And then we just get ourselves some wheels. Uh, landing. Landing wheels. Yeah, we need wheels, so why not? This is literally just a car. I'm building a car, guys. <laughs> right? Yeah, that's looking nice. And now we need something to push us really fast, so let's go for these things. Oh, look at this beast. Look at this beast! Is that going to stay on? <laughs> oh dear. Does it work? Do we need fuel? Guessing we kind of need fuel to make it work. Do we need fuel? I'm guessing we do. Let's just get rid of these. I wondered if we, if we need like... Like, uh, like a, a massive engine to do it. Because we're not going to take off. So we probably could do it. Quite easily. Uh, this turbo fan guzzles fuel like you wouldn't believe. Alright, so what about if we just add some fuel tanks? Don't really know. I've never used these before, so I don't really know, like, like ha ha what I need. Alright, if we just put this on the back of there. Guess we have fuel tanks now. Yep, yeah, we have fuel. <laughs> we, we could just do it. Oh, hey, oh look at this. It's working! <clears throat> okay, 100. <coughs> oh, dear me. 200. Oh, no, it's going. Wee! Man. All right, so how, how are we supposed to get some downforce here? This is where the, this is this is tricky. This is going to be very tricky, isn't it? I like the look of it so far, though. Looks pretty ace. All right, what about if we add one there and one there? And then we added... Another one like that, and another one like that. Yes! That's what I'm talking about. Look at this, guys. Look at this. This is amazing. 
Don't leave the ground. Don't leave the ground. Don't leave the ground. <gasps> it might not leave the ground. Oh, no. We need to do another 200 miles an hour more. Okay, I've got an idea. This is going to be legit. Let's back out. Back out. Grab these. Don't need these anymore. We need some more big jets. So, as long as it's heavy. The Blaster VTOL. Look at this bad boy. Yes. Speed is key. Is this working? Are these front ones even doing anything? Oh, they are now. This one's spinning. This one's doing nothing. I don't. I think it's going to be slower. It's on 300. 400. Yeah, it's much slower. I think. They didn't actually do anything. Right, these are rubbish. Take these off. This is pretty good, actually, because I'm, I'm starting to learn uh, about the different uh, jets and what actually works. Let's go for these bad boys again. These are massive. I like these. These are good. This is where the party's at. This is definitely where the party's at. Can we put it, like, there? That's definitely in the wrong place. Is this one... Why, why, what's, what's with the camera? Camera's gone mental. There we go. That's where I wanted it. Okay, let's see if this happens now. <laughs> it looks so stupid. Let's go! Woo! Yes! Oh, listen to that. This has got, like, purple coming out the back. We might actually make this. 600. Oh, we just need a little bit more runway. Okay, more jets. More jets! That's what we need. We need plenty more jets. Okay, I think we can squeeze another two on the top of here. We definitely should be able to squeeze another one. Uh, yeah, why not? Let's just put another one there. And another one there. If it works. Is it going to work? It does as well. <laughs> the world's fastest car is here, guys. The world's fastest car. We're going to do this easy. We're going to smash this. I think... Oh, no! Oh, this is so tricky. Right, okay. This is literally so tricky. Let's get rid of these. What else do we have at our disposal? Um, I like these ones. Can we put some of these ones back on? Yes. Right, and then... Yeah, why not? Why not? Why not, guys? <laughs> I love it. Okay, I think we're a little bit too heavy. We need some more on the back. That's how I balance weight out. We just need to put some more on the back to be able to balance it. Let's put another one of these on the back. There we go. That should sort of balance it out, right? Yes! Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I think... Whoa, what have I done there? Um, excuse me. There we go. Is it because this one's out of sync? That might be the culprit. Let's try to, like, weigh us forward. Okay, let's do this. We just need full power from the start. Otherwise, we're not going to have enough runway. Come on! It's lifting off of the front a little bit. I think we got this. Yes! <laughs> we did it! We did it! Nailed it! Oh, man, that was legit. That was so good. Ah, oh, yes. I'm going to save this vehicle as well. Oh, wait, where's my... No, where's my... Where's my... Oh, there we go. There's my vehicle. Uh, save vehicle. The squid nug fast. Yes, there we go. So that's the end of Simple Plays today, guys. Hopefully you have enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. Oh, if you want me to do some more, let me know. And I'll uh, record some more. We've got two more to do. We've got short landing. We've got some... We've got a bit Sam again. So yeah, my name is Screw. I hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you all later. Woo!